Hello, I'm Bob Arrigo. Um, this is a brand new Facebook page and for any first time visitors, I thought I would give you a, a quick look see at uh, the studio I work in and um, and just want to wish you all welcome. So round for a moment and here is a quick look at my studio. I've got a few works in process of uh, in process right now. Um, at any rate, I have lots of table space, which is kind of an essential um, in a studio. Um, I usually have two or three different palettes going, some with acrylic, some with oil. Uh, there's commissions on the go here. And um, also, I have got probably 50 or 60 uh, pieces, original works in uh, in. Uh, different genres, abstract, uh, florals, uh, a lot of landscapes, things like that, and a lot of experimental pieces too. Um, always uh, uh, following my inspiration and uh, looking for uh, new things to paint and new, and new uh, people to satisfy. So uh, this is a work I've got actually in progress right now. And uh, as an introductory uh, video, I want to maybe uh, show you a little uh, interesting point about how I set up my, you'll see there's no easel here. And uh, I'll show you why in just a moment. Uh, let me turn around. And um, I'll show you how I have set that up because it's uh, really helpful um, if you're an artist especially it's it's helpful um, with an easel a traditional easel um, it's a matter of always lifting the actual changing the configuration of the easel to move it up or to move it down and um, sorry about that interruption somebody at my studio door um, so anyways I wanted to show you uh, how I set up my easel because it's, um, it's, it's really conducive to uh, great productivity and, and comfort for the artist as well. Um, it's straight up and down for one thing, um, so you don't get the reflected light. If you're working on an easel and the easel is slanted, you're going to get reflected light sometimes, and it's a little confusing to, to get the detailing and the you know, information you need. So at any rate, um, what I've, did, I've done is set this up if I've got on the wall I've got all these pieces here are actually cut at an angle down like that okay and on the back of the canvas I've got the part you see that profile so it just interlocks down with the uh, with the the wall. So if I'm working at the bottom of the canvas, I can simply move it up and work where it's comfortable for me to work. Uh, if I need to work at the top, I can move it down wherever I need to. So it's always comfortable. So that's just a little hint. And if you're an artist, I hope that helps. Um, if you're uh, interested in the studio tour, whether live or virtual, we're always here. So uh, connect with me. And uh, love to help you out with uh, whatever your needs may be if you're a designer or if you're looking for something that's a commemorative piece or something like that. Um, always available to chat. Just love to hear more about you and your life and what you do. Never mind what I do, but what, what you do, it's really important. And uh, I'd love to talk to you soon. Thank you.